from last week, all right? We're gonna do the snatch. So we're gonna start at the bottom and then we're gonna go to position one that we did last week. Take your feet and you wanna stop them right beneath your hips, okay? Because remember, when we end up on the descent of the snatch, that's where we're gonna kinda shuffle out to our squat stance. So take your hands, touch your thumbs to the outside of your thighs. Take your two peace fingers, wrap around your thumbs. What is this called? Hook oh, grip. Now, take your hand and walk it out. Take your other hand and walk it out so that bar is right around waist level. You wanna make sure this bar doesn't move. So kick your legs up one or two times and make sure that bar is not moving, okay? If you guys remember from last week, get into position one. Anybody remember? Shoulders back. Shoulders back, which prompts your chest up, which makes your back flat. Do we all feel how tight our back is? Yes. Yep. Okay. Position two, we're gonna go down to position, very good. Position two is your shins, okay? Make sure your weight is in your heels and your back is flat. Show me your shirt. Position three, right above your knees, and we're going to rapidly go position four to five. So hip, M, V. Stand it up. Shake it out, reset. Position one. Position two. Okay, Kenny, get your butt down. Show me your shirt, show me your shirt. Excellent, relax. Matthew, stand up and reset yourself. Throw your shoulders back to position one. Roll down to position two. Lock your elbows out. Okay, position three, four, five. Awesome, we're gonna go through it slowly one more time.